I'm Todd Grisham, and all the seats have been sold. We're live at the Empire Fight Camp. Alongside me, English fighting legend Johnny Nelson. Looking forward to this one, Todd. It's time for our tale of the tape. Deontay. The Gypsy. This bout is scheduled for 10 rounds of boxing. In. You've heard of people dancing. They ring the bell, and here we go. That big hook doesn't land. They're both going for the KO. It's so obvious. Nice job getting that punch through. the legendary rivalries in heavyweight boxing history is revived in this one. Wilder versus Fury again. Warfare is so important in boxing. And Tyson Fury is a modern day war mover. He knows how to get in your head before you've even stepped in the room, before you've even laced up the gloves, before you've even got in the dressing room. Tyson Fury knows what to do to get under your skin. You make you hate him, love him, dream about him. So then he's your life. It's his line. He's got your number. He's brilliant. And you saw how he did it to in fight one, fight two, and in fight three. And the same thing's happening all over again. Will Wilder ever know? Will he ever learn his lesson? I believe not. Because Tyson Fury, that's what he do. Needs to put some combination work together. What do you believe what we are seeing? goes down. One, two, three, four, five. Let's talk about Wilder in that last one. We're hoping for an all-action slugfest. Got to get the momentum shift coming their way. What can they do here? What a knockdown. One minute, you need one hour to get over a shot like that. Now it's down to conditioning. Now it's down to mental strength and preparation. It's how you are going to deal with this. Looking at social media right now, Johnny, and the entire boxing world is buzzing about this battle under the stars. It's been a long, long day, Todd. They've been drinking, they've been out in the sun, everybody's been having a good time, but this is what they've been waiting for. This crowd can be very unpredictable, and by the sense of it, it's night time now. They're waiting, they're waiting for that big fight. There's a lot of pressure on these fighters' shoulders to get that job done and perform. Hey, those punches add up. This has been a very competitive round as we reach the midway point. That uppercut misses. Perfectly matched. Skill for skill. Tap for tap. Now this fight will say, you know what, I'm just that notch above you. And so I've got to respect both of them. More than happy. Putting up the high guard to protect his face, but his body's open. Just missed with that jab. One punch could change every... Despite what the judges' scorecards read, there are no losers in this one. Throws a punt. Let's talk about Wilder in that last round. Well, this. And there's the bell to start the round. Not the start that they wanted, but let's see what they can do in this round. That was a tough last round. Now you've got to make sure he doesn't put it on him. That's what he's going to try and do. So tie him up, hold him, lean on him. Don't get drawn into a fight. Not yet. Not until your senses have come back.
beautiful counter shot. This fighter told us yesterday, I don't get paid by the minute. I'm going to go in there and try and knock my opponent out as soon as possible. Tactics out of the window. These guys just want to brawl. Punch, counter punch. It's all offense all the time. How about that time counter shot? You'd like to see more jabs. Halfway through the round, I'm not sure who's winning it. Very close match. It shows the skill, the discipline, the respect both fighters have for each other because no one's there do anything out of turn. Not a lot of punch output. Thought there might be more action here. He threw a punch and just got countered. If you're a counter puncher, then basically you do the counter attack. You let them get their punch off first, and then you answer in time. They have got great wind IQ. Counter punches are the best. That hook doesn't score. You know the scorecards are going to be all over the place in this one. Let's talk about Wilder in that last round. You know that bell was sweet music to his... They ring the bell, and here we go. Off their stools and ready to go. Let's hope this round is more competitive. They've had one minute to recover. Now they've got to block it. They've got to block it. They've got to come up now and style it out. Get on the back foot. Jab. Rest on the jab. Be smart and pop until your legs come back. Then, put the pressure on. Just as quickly as the action slows down, it heats back up. Back and forth they go. It's the typical big man, little man argument. He's got to be quicker. He's got to move a lot to win this fight. There's a lot of weight there to give away, and if you're giving it away that weight, you've got to use it to the maximum because you've got to be smart. Every shot hurts. It's not about skill. It's more about power. Both fighters landing in these exchanges. Judge is going to have a tough job. Skill for skill, tap for tap. She's like a match made in heaven. Nice job getting that punch through. To be careful for that receipt, it's always coming. Every time he throws a punch, a receipt is coming right back. Good right hand. Very close round with 10 seconds to go. Let's talk about Wilder in that last round. And a round that seemed like an... And there's the bell to start the round. Well, they got battered last round. How do they turn their fortunes around? This is one of those situations. You've just been hurt. You've got to get out there again. Be smart. Be sharp. Don't be a fool. Don't get suckered in. Make him fight your fight. Hold and tie him up just until your head clears again and your legs come back again. Because if you don't, he's going to pop you off. They call it the glory division. There's nothing quite like a heavyweight fight. It doesn't take much to win it. Got him there. Insane action. Not a lot of punch output. Thought there might be more action here. Both of these fighters have had their moments. 
They're so close, so close. How can you separate them? It's going to be a hard night tonight for the judges. In this division, both fighters will constantly be on their toes trying to punch and counterpunch. Sometimes when you get in there with someone that's so powerful, you've got to think him. You've just got to be smarter than him. You've got to be like a little fag in a big bucket then. Not a lot of punch output. Thought there would be uh, some more action here. The winner of this, this round's still up for grabs with just 10 seconds to go. That counter shot lands. What's the referee thinking right now? Let's talk about Wilder in that last round. From this moment forward, he cannot afford to lose another round. Every second, every minute of this fight is important. We're hoping for an all-action slugfest. Well done with that counter shot. These two featherweights are going to let their hands go. You know that. Middleweight always gives us a class. If you've got two class middleweight fighters, you are in for action. I'm quite sure right now, if you know your boxing, there's a certain fighter, Mr. Mr. I would just say marvelous, but some fighters were unbelievable middleweight. Those who thought this would be a mismatch, you are sorely wrong. Skill for skill, tap for tap. Just like a match made in heaven. When are we going to see a jab from these two? Oh, that punch. Oh, my. That's a game changer. Talking about Wilder in that last one. We're hoping for an all-action slugfest. His eyes look pretty clear here, Johnny. How do you think he's going to do after being knocked down in the last round? What a heavy knockdown. How are they going to come back from that? They staggered back to the corner. They've got to freshen them up, alert them again, get them back on point again. This round, they've got to coast around. Don't get involved. Give yourself another three minutes to get your head clear. punch, a receipt is coming right back. Well, Johnny, we're a couple rounds in. What are you seeing so far? Work the body, frustrate them, take the mind off the chin, take the mind off protecting everything around that. Work the body, use tactics sometimes to sort of watch you out, box the fight and beat them on points. Big hook, good thing it didn't land. Stumbling around in potholes, in serious trouble. Take, he's gonna take a knee. First thing the fighter did, otherwise, you know what? Pride's gonna get you knocked out. Seven, eight. Nice counter shot. That uppercut misses. Not a lot of punch output. Thought there might be so much for defensive abilities.
So it's onward and upward after another knockout win here. What a build-up. What a journey towards this fight. What a fight itself. The crowd enjoyed it. The fighters enjoyed it. I certainly enjoyed it. And what a way to end the fight. There's no mistake there about who won. What a shot.